Hi guys, thought I'd just come on this morning to talk to you about some new mascaras and, and eyeshadow, which isn't that new. I have today Skylight by Maybelline, which um, if you want to see the brush, it's the little plasticky one. Sorry, I'm wearing this because I hurt myself the other day. And then we also have a wet table. I broke my drink. Um, the Revolution 5D, I think it's called. And that just looks like this. Uh, I'm going to do one on each eye so we can see the difference. These are my lashes now. I don't know if you can see, but they're fairly long anyway. So um, I've just done my base face. Face, face, that's the right word. I've got a mirror down here. I just had my breakfast and it's not getting my teeth, sorry, I'm making disgusting noises. Uh, oh, this is this brush. I haven't opened this one yet. So they have a similar brush, but these ones have a slightly different um, bristle, if that makes sense. I don't, I'm not sure what material this one is, but if I just give them two both at the same time, you might be able to tell. Look at hell. Do you know what I mean? Like the bottom one is more plasticky, the other one's more like, I want to call it feathery, but that's not really the right word. But I'm going to use that anyway. I said it was Jay's turn to um, make breakfast. So what's he done? Gone to McDonald's. At least he woke up to be fair. Anyway, I'm going in with Revolution first on, well, it'll be my left. I don't know if you'll see it as your left, but. It's quite nice actually, it's quite th thin, so then you can like build if that makes sense. I know that quite a lot of the mascaras I used to use were really thick straight away. I will get it all over my lid though. I'm a mirror here. Mm -hmm. oh, I do actually really like that. That goes on really nicely. I do quite a lot of coats anyway, but that's a really nice one. And then we've got the skylight. Let's have a look. I don't know if uh, people with weird eye issues are going to have a problem with this. My mum is very much like, ew, don't touch your eye. A little bit like Rachel from Friends. Um, but I don't know if this will be like, ew, don't do that. Do like my tablecloth? It's cute, isn't it? It's fridge. This one's slightly thicker. Which again I like because it's not like massively thick. And I think the um the bristles on this one are thicker, which makes the um mascara go on thicker. I'll show you in a minute once I've fannied about and like them. I like my lashes to look really thick but still individual and some of them look really really clumpy. Can you see the difference? You might not. This side's thicker, but more individual. It looks like I've got more lashes, I feel like. Anyway, um, I think I actually might use both of them at the same time. Oh, yeah, pick up, sorry. I might put this one on and then brush with this one because I like how they both look and I want to use both of them, so. I might do another layer on this so it looks like the same like consistent hello consistency. Oh there you go, yeah. <laughs> oh these actually have fibres in them I just remembered. Because look how, <laughs> look how long they are now. 
I just remembered these have fibres in them, so they'll be like the Revolution one I done oh, probably a year ago now actually, maybe a few months ago. Yeah, this is the thing it comes in. And it says, it does say somewhere, yeah, two-way fibre technology. One swipe for, for impact. Oh, it's just a security tag right in the way. Thank you, pal. That's just the ingredients. This one is super black. Uh, that's the only one Superdrug have at the moment. Obviously, if you go to different ones, they might not have it all together or they might have some other ones. But I think because it's that new, they just have the black one at the moment. They don't have... Um, I don't think they do a brown anyway, but they just don't have the waterproof one right now. So, that is them. I really like them, actually. I'm staring at myself like this. It's really strange. Right, now... I want to show you this because I really like it and I've lost it for a while. Let me just take the crap off. I also really like this sponge, but um, they don't do them anymore. It was a super drug and they do like a lipstick shape one and a normal sponge one. But for some reason I like the lip one because it, um, It's just bigger and it's got like the right points. I can use this bit for my eye, I can use this bit for everything, I can like, you know, whatever. Right, so this is I Love Revolution and it's called Chocolate Meat. I found this, or we found this the other day. <coughs> Look at all these colours and it's got a bit with it but you're showing me my drink. This drink, don't buy this, it's broken. Anyway, this is the second one I broke because so I'm having a paddy. These are really nice colours, I really, really like these colours. I am going to use basically the top four. Um, This brown is a slightly darker brown. This brown is darker than this brown. Sorry, that was really confusing. So I'm gonna use the top four. And I really like these ones because obviously Revolution is so pigmented, I'm using my things today, if it will let me. That's why. And there's that one. I wonder where that went. Right, I'm just going to go in. I, I'm going to go for a walk and a FaceTime today with my friend. Um, I might vlog it, I'm not sure. We might do like a, I don't know, sister's question something, answer something. No, we might not, so never mind. But anyway, I'm going to go in with this first. Hello, me. This one first. No, I'm really sorry, I'm not. I'm going to go in with this goldy one first. And I like the fact that it's got a mirror on it, because if I have to... I'm also using this brush. It's just a normal, like, angled one. It's not got angled, you know what I mean? I like going in the middle first, because I feel like that's where everything is, if that makes sense. That's the main bit that everybody sees. I kind of need to start with that one. See what I mean? It's really pigmented already. You can't see on here, which is quite annoying. But I've just tapped it twice on here. Maybe you should shake it off, but I didn't because I like bright colours. And I literally, it sounds really weird, I put it like, you know where your eye kind of start, starts? So I put it there, onwards, and then round. Because this brown is quite matted, so I don't mind it being like on top of a shimmery one, because then when I blend them together, it um, will look a bit shimmery, so. Right, next one. No, I'm not, I'm gonna do just one eye, and then the other one. See how that editing works. Right, now, I'm going in, and I'm taking the purple off. I need a brush cleaner, that's what I'm going into town for. A little fluffy one. I like the fluffy one for the outside because I feel like the outside needs to be more like blended or more soft or more whatever you want to call it. Where the inside I feel like needs to be a bit more harsh. Sometimes I go in an angled brush and I go from like, I kind of angle it that way and then swoop. Um, that's always a nice one. I'll show you that one uh, when there's another product. I don't want to do like, this is how I do my makeup because there's so many other people using the brown one, just 
I'm literally just dabbing it here until I'm comfortable, then swooping it like slightly over. I'll show you in a minute. But yeah, I don't want to do like, this is how I do my makeup every day because so many people do that, like James Charles or Jeffree Star or um, literally 15 others at least. And they are like way better than me. So there's no point in me being like, this is how I do my makeup because it's crap. As you can see, because what the hell is going on here? I also then get a cotton bud if I don't like it or just wipe a lot of it off like that. I don't know why I show you my makeup because sometimes I don't like it. I really like the fact that it does this. And then I feel like this brush is too big to then do this. But I do it anyway, because I'm a dumbass. But then also I'll go back in and go over if I don't like it. I feel like this is just slightly too high. See, it looks different on there for some reason. It looks like I've just plonked here and I haven't done anything. I have washed my hands, don't worry. They say you shouldn't touch your face at all. Obviously with everything going on, duh, but they um they say you shouldn't touch your face because your hands touch so many things. That's better, kind of. It's not a shape I want, but I'll reshape in a minute. <clears throat> and then just really slightly with just a really small brush. Really little. I just go in with this like whitey one. I'm not going to use this one, I'm going to use this one. I might blend in a minute. So literally I've got like the smallest bit on. I really like this one because it's so like colourful. Can you see that already? I don't always get my makeup right. I know what I want and then I fanny about and it looks like almost a drag queen. I don't know if anybody else has that issue. But I for sure do. Because also my eyes are, um, I think they're called quite hooded. So I've got quite a lot of actual space, but you can't see it. So I I can see where my eye is supposed to be. I can see to go around here, but then I've gone all the way up here and I look a bit like a mess. You are just supposed to do the smallest bit. And then I think, oh yeah, but that bit's missed a bit. And actually all I have to do is just blend. Stop being a weirdo. Right, now I'm going to do this side. Oh, we haven't done this at all. But yeah. That is my look today. These are the two different lashes. I don't know if you can tell they're that different anymore. Thank God. But if I go out looking like a loony tick. Um, if I had to pick a favourite. That's a hard one actually. I shouldn't have done that. If I had to pick a favourite, it would be this one. Just because it's got fibres in it. And I know how to work with fibres because you've seen my uh, unique one. But also, this is quite thin, so you can build a lot more. This one you obviously can build on, and it's not hard to just like scrape some stuff off. Um, I prefer this brush normally, so I'm in a dilemma. But I might just use both of them, and they're not different sizes, and they're different sizes. So um, this one at the moment, because they have an uh, introduction sale on, is six ninety nine. Um, from Revolution, just Revolution, not Revolution Pro, not I Love Revolution, just normal Revolution. Um, and the Maybelline one was, it was, I think it was eight ninety nine, but it was two for twelve, so you get two for six pound each, basically. Um, it's not just these; it's everything on Maybelline and everything on Rimmel, but you can't swap. Go into Superdrug and have a look. Uh, they got some good deals on at the moment. <laughs> But yeah, these are them and my favourite eyeshadow. I am now going to FaceTime and... Do I have to Google some quiz questions or stupid questions if that's what she wants to do. If not, we might just chat about hair. I also want to change my hair. Put it down in the comments. Also, look, my hair's short, as we know. Put it down in the comments if I look like Severus Snape. Like, seriously, how can you say I don't look? Let me do it properly. Tell me this is not Snape. How? 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 How can you tell me this is not Snape? But anyway, the next hair I want, and I might film, and you're obviously going to leave these in because these are great. They have to stay in for, hmm, I think it's four months or something like that. And I just had them in 
a week before Christmas. What's really annoying me is I dyed my hair black to match this. And where I was red before, I, I don't know if you saw, I didn't film anything. I was half red, half green. So you can see the green coming out and you can see the red coming out, if it will let you. Can you see? So um, I kind of have to do a slightly whatever middle parting so I don't look weird. But I really like this colour right now. I don't like whatever's going on here. Let me just But anyway, yeah, my next hair colour, when I take these out, I'm going to go like a ginger colour. Yes, it means I have to bleach it, but I'm going to do it professionally this time. But maybe. Anyway, I'm rambling. I'm sorry. Thank you for watching. Thanks for staying this long. Please like, subscribe, comment what you want me to do next or what you want us to do next. And we will. Hopefully, obviously, I don't know if you know we're in another lockdown. I don't know who's watching. Uh, we're in lockdown again, so there will be a lot less stuff we're able to do. But I would also really like to do health, fitness stuff. So whether that means I show you a workout for bigger girls or whether I show you how to dress yourself for, to be a bigger woman or what I eat in a day, I might do that. That sounds like a real big motivation to kick myself and be like oh damn the internet knows i'm disgusting therefore change let me know thanks guys